SCP-4478. This one is interesting because this is this is what you load into. Uh, some of them do play around with the format a little bit, but I don't think I've ever loaded into just a blank screen like this one. We do see that the anomaly class is Keter, <clears throat> and you have one interactive line of text: load underscore trigger. So you have a monastic trigger loaded. So monastic is the opposite of amnestic, uh, which is something that helps you retain a concept um, or reverse an amnestic effect. Information unsuppressed. Containment procedures. 4478 is contained on site at the University of Warwick under guise of a maintenance hallway. The inside of Zone Penrose has been coated with containment grade steel plating with entry limited to a covert subterranean tunnel. All previous exits have been sealed. Access to Zone Penrose is forbidden to personnel without level 5 Gradibus philosophical certification. Um, so this, this would be very high. Level 5 typically is associated with an overseer um, or a director on a very high project um, where they might know more than even their site director. While 4478 is a former staircase, Zone Penrose itself possesses no relation to stairs. Subtle mimetic transfer agents embedded within 5.2% of all Foundation media contain this fact, which all relevant Foundation personnel should now possess knowledge of. The above trigger will have relieved your subconscious suppression of the knowledge, and the fact that Zone Penrose possesses no relation to stairs will persist in your short-term memory until your relationship with the SCP-4478 containment system is terminated. 4478 is an indeterminate and partially undefined space within the University of Warwick, England. Originally a flight of stairs, 4478 spontaneously developed a growth in ontology and a leakage of literary properties into the surrounding environment. Although it has grown in size since initial containment, it has not yet expanded out of its own Penrose due to the orchestrated incompatibility of the two semantic fields. Because of the inherent hazards posed by stairs <laughs> and the exacerbation of these hazards within 4478, Entry into the region by living and or sapient personnel is not recommended. 4478 currently contains 44 persons, of whom 16 are deceased and 28 are missing in action. The following is a record of known dissociated properties of 4478. The property type metaphor. Assumed property description. Stairs as journey. Targets of property. Self. 4478 slash stairs in general. So... It seems using this metaphor of using stairs as a journey uh, causes portions of the target to randomly extend, branch, and halt unexpectedly in defiance of physical constraints. Flights of stairs traveled at different times will lead to different destinations. Subtext. Stairs are simple compared to other methods of vertical movement, suggesting a lack of technological advancement. Targets of property, subjects within SCP-4478. Targets will have their knowledge of concepts more advanced than stairs slowly erased by long-term exposure to 4478. No other methods of vertical movement, including escalators, lifts, and jumping, are able to exist conceptually within 4478. Simile. Stairs are like humans. Both climb upwards without leaving their starting position. Goals and aspirations of subjects within 4478 is the target. Targets are physically represented as staircases, with the base acting as the individual's immovable reality. Climbing these staircases results in individuals entering their own aspirations recursively. Implication. The existence of stairs suggests an eventual destination which is either lesser or greater than one's current position, has an effect on abstract reality. Within 4478, the target continuously expands and segments into upper and lower components, which subdivide recursively. Staircases are the only physical objects capable of transitioning between these areas while remaining unaffected by them. Personnel within a dividing area will have biomass split evenly among the resultant sub-areas. Mm. Metaphor. Stairs as ascension. Again, targeting self-4478. Uh, 
small portions of the target represent a method of ascension to a presumed higher plane of reality. No persons have ever returned from such ascensions. The locations of prior ascensions can be distinguished by the faint sounds of laughter, classical piano music, indistinct voices, and repetitive wet thuds. Foreshadowing. The existence of stairs portents a fall. Subject, any or all entities related to or interacting with stairs. The effect is not yet known. Uh-huh. So this is very highly rated. I like the presentation. I'm not sure I understand why it is Keter. However, I think there's something about this that I'm not understanding. Um, so I'm going to go in, into the discussion and see um, if the author, as they sometimes do... Um, Spoilers, the stairs are a metaphor for stairs. Okay, so here's a here's a little explanation. It's a literary, ontological, rhetorical anomaly which expands and grows wildly, dangerously, and unpredictably. The only way to contain it is to trap it within something that possesses an entirely different semantic field. The way to artificially orchestrate this makes sure everybody who knows about this rapper concept, Zone Penrose, also understands that it bears no linguistic relation to the anomaly. Make this understanding involuntary and unambiguous and Bob's your second degree male relative, you've now got a literary wall through which the anomaly can't pass. It's Keter because most of its effects are unknown, it's unpredictably dangerous, and may be able to affect things outside of its geographical location. Hmm. <laughs> oh, that's interesting. They named it Zone Penrose after that. Okay, so um, that is 4478. It's very highly rated. I have to say I can tell that it's well put together, but I'm still left a little confused. And I know that I'm supposed to be a little confused but I'm not quite sure where the punchline is on this one. Anyways, um, put it all out there so you know you can decide for yourself. Um, I still liked it. Uh, probably not gonna vote on this one because I just I feel like I'm missing something. And I hear a phrase often that no matter how obvious you think you're being with something subtle, you need to be more obvious. And that's maybe the case here. But again, maybe that's just for me. Uh, maybe someone understands this perfectly and they think I'm an idiot, in which case, please let me know. In the meantime, I hope you enjoyed this one. Uh, let me know if you have any feedback on what other content you'd like me to cover, and uh, I'd hope to see you back in another one. Thank you.